No, Kitty, for the last time, we're not going to get rid of the dog. Why? Because she's not what stinks. She is. No, Kitty, she's not. I don't even think you understand. She's disgusting. No, she's a good girl. The only reason you don't like her is because you're a cat. Yeah. And sadly, nobody in the house is going to eat till we get rid of the stink. The what? The stink, Kitty. I can't believe you don't smell it. But we know it wasn't Shelby Girl's fault because she's a dog, and she doesn't poop in the house like Kitty Cat. She poops outside. Ew. No, it, it's a good thing, Kitty. Oh. Um, and you should be grateful. Could you imagine Shelby's giant dookie pile sitting inside the litter box with you, buddy? No. Yeah, yeah there wouldn't be any room to move, but hey, I I'm gonna go open up a window or something, okay? Whatever. I'll be back. There we go. Much better. So yeah, other than the stink that's completely taken over the house, things have been going pretty good lately. About a week ago, Gibby-san tried to challenge Sylvester for his chair, and it turned into a complete freaking disaster. And then Random Kitty picked up a new hobby. She actually started watching TV, which was all cute and fine and everything, until all of a sudden a Rub Doctor commercial came on and complete panic ensued. Okay, just calm down, Kitty. Calm down. It was just a commercial, okay? There's nothing to worry about. They're not real. I mean, they, they are real, but that's... No, uh, give me son, you too. Hey, guys! You and you are being ridiculous. Just calm down. I mean, seriously. Random, you're, you're not allowed to watch TV again. Eventually, they came down and everything was fine until today when I came home and the entire house smells like somebody took a dump in the ventilation system. I think I know exactly what happened, though, because when I... I'm hungry! Every freaking time. Kitty, do you remember what I said? Yep. <laughs> Remember what I did? Random kitty, that is not necessary. Anyways, like I said, nobody in the house gets to eat until we get rid of the stink. What? Yeah, Sylvester, you you know how to use a litter box, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, somebody in the house doesn't because they took a giant poop and they didn't even cover it up. Gross. Yeah, I know. So I got to ask you a personal question. Sylvester, did you take a poop today? Yeah. Okay, and when you were done, did you take the time to use your paw and the litter and everything and cover it up so it doesn't stink up the whole house? I did. Okay, then you're good. I gotta check the others, though. Hey, Random Kitty. How are you doing, girl? <laughs> okay. Hey, hey, Random, did you take a poop today? Yeah. <laughs> you did? D did you cover it up? R random Kitty, did you did you cover it up? Yeah. When When you took a poop, did you cover it up today, Random Kitty? Hey, I, Llama's not an answer. Ra All right, let's, let's go to the litter box. Yeah, that nasty thing right there. I need you to cover it up. Ran random. Kitty, that's not doing any... Random, I need you to really try. Just get it from a different angle, okay? Random, are you kidding right now? Seriously, cover it up. Oh, my God. Okay, so I figured it out. It was Random Kitty the whole time. Yeah? Yeah, that little kitty cat has no idea how to use a litter box. Yeah. But I think I know how to make sure that it doesn't happen again. What? <laughs> you, buddy. You can teach her how to use a litter box. You've been doing it forever. And you're going to have to use the bathroom at some point today, right? Yeah. Okay, so before you do, you just make sure and let me know so that we can teach Random Kitty, okay? Okay. Thanks, buddy. You know, I always just kind of thought the cats instinctively knew how to use a litter box. I didn't think they'd have to be trained, but I should have known better after that one time when Sylvester took it's a... It's showtime! Oh, it's time. Hey, guys, this next scene might be a little disgusting. Uh, luckily, I have a sensor bubble. It's kind of small, and I don't know how to make it any bigger, but hopefully this will do the trick, so let's do it. Okay, watch and learn, random kitty. Sylvester's going to show you how to do... Oh, no, my sensor bubble is not even close to big enough. Ew. See how he's doing that? See how he's getting it from that angle, and he's not just scraping at the wall? You see, kitty? Yeah, and then you just switch it up, get it from the other side, and make sure that it doesn't stink up. He, no, he, he doesn't need your help. Stop. And now he's showing us exactly what not to do. Sylvester, in the box, cover up that little tip right there, okay? No, you're, that, you're going the wrong way. Oh my god, I don't want to do this, but look, like this. See? Kitties? Watching? Yeah? See? And we're done. Okay, Random Kitty, so what did you learn from today? Yeah. From today? Yeah. Today's... Yeah. Random Kitty, I need you to be serious with me for a second. Yeah. Random, what did you learn from today's yeah. lesson? Yeah. Random Kitty. Yeah. Seriously. Yeah. Alright, so I take it everything today was completely pointless. Alright, good talk. Thanks. Dear Diary, February 33rd. I find it ironic that my human slave makes fun of us kitty cats for not knowing how to use a litter box when he doesn't even know how to clean it. It's true. The dog's been cleaning our litter box every day for as long as I can remember. Watching her swallow pounds of my fecal matter gives me such joy. Honestly, it's one of the reasons why I eat so much. Gotta do my part, you know? I gotta, I gotta feed that dog. That's all for now, diary. Until next time.